gonna start it out like this hi my name is monica and welcome back to my channel like comment and subscribe and the reason why i'm making this video is because tiktok has me on jail girl i've been in jail since sunday and i appealed it they didn't take it off it's okay but then this is what's killing me though tiktok not only got me on in jail but they got me on in jail and for the video that they got me in jail for people are stitching it if you don't believe me, go to the video. I I do edit both of the videos. Go down there and look. My voice is still on there. But they got me in jail again. So this is what I'm going to do from this point on. My main channel is going to be my YouTube channel. When I do get out of uh, TikTok jail, which I'm in TikTok jail again for no reason, I'm going to every now and again post on here. Because, see, at the end of the day, I don't have that type of time with, t with TikTok. Now, I can see if I got on there and I was talking about something, but I truly believe that somebody reported that video being malicious because of what I had said about my mom's family. But we, that's nevertheless, I have to let that go. My main objective is to get on here and be something on here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let all that go because at the end of the day, what, what, is, that, what is that accomplishing? TikTok does what TikTok want to do. And what they not what they not gonna do is stop me from being who I am. So what I'm gonna start doing is using this platform, which is my YouTube. I'm gonna use this platform to get where I need to be. And I'm gonna still tell my stories. I'm gonna still be Monica. But at the end of the day, I can't let TikTok or nobody else stop me from my goals. And that's the, that's it. And that's all because I see other creators. I'm not gonna say. I'm I'm not gonna say that they're all the way prejudiced. I'm gonna say this. All these black creators that I have seen have made backup pages because of this reason here. But I see I have a backup page, but why should I have to use that backup page? It's okay because see what I'm going to do is I'm going to generate the crowd that I need to generate off of my YouTube. And then every now and again, I'm going to get on TikTok and do what I do. But I, I can't let TikTok stop me because if I did, then I would not be a creator. What I would be is... I would let them stop me. I would let them stop me. But at the end of the day, I can't let them stop me. So what I'm going to do is from this point on, I'm going to make the videos that I want to make. And I'm going to make them on YouTube. And I'm going to get my audience that I need. Because at the end of the day, I can't, I can't sit and rely on the fact that TikTok is pissed off. Because on that video that I had took that they took down, that video has something like 65,000 likes. They would have had to try to pay me, what, three cents? Three cents? A uh, uh, thousand or something like this? But I so, Okay, I mean, I'm just going to go ahead and make this cut and dry. Because I didn't want to get on here long. Because, honey, do I got stories for y'all. Because not only is my mom's family in the uproar, but now my dad's family. I done found out some stuff about on they side. So, I have to start a whole new series about they family. My other side of the family. But then I got to tell y'all about my mom and this uh, pig roast. And I got to tell y'all about how my best friend is leaving. But I got stories about, like, the ugly duckling and stuff like this. It's stories out here that needs to be told. I'm not going to let them stop me. So at, when we finish with this journey, and this is a journey because this is not a niche. This is not... Yeah, this is entertainment, but this is also my life. So if I want to tell y'all my life and... Without being judged or being fingers being pointed and stuff like this. Let that be. Because people work too hard on TikTok or on all these other platforms to be having to subside to rules that is unbelievable. I never did nothing wrong. If I did, then why is people still stitching the video that I created? And then not only did they do that, but they just left it in limbo. Like I was going to be just... just Allow them to do this. So I've made several videos. I have about everything I have and I did that for a reason, but most of all They're not going to stop me. So understand this. I may not be Charlie Domenio or or uh, These other big creators. No, I'm not I am a small fish in a big pond and what I'm not going to do is allow one channel one platform to stop me so what I'm not going to do is allow TikTok to get on my nerve. I'm not. So those that have stuck it out with me, I thank you. And for my new viewers, listen, y'all are in for a treat. Go back and start looking at my stories, honey. Because listen, I have a talent that's unmeasurable. 
once I get started, I'm just going to get started. But for now, I have to just think strategically and get this done. Because this is something that I enjoy doing. And I enjoy it because of you guys. So stick in there with me because, honey, we are in for the long haul. Because I refuse to allow TikTok or anybody stop me from what I need to do. So if I feel comfortable with talking to y'all or whatever it is, just stick it out with me. Because, honey, listen, they're not stopping anything but themselves. And I thank y'all for watching. So I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.